Hello there, how are you? My name is Olive. Good morning, good afternoon, whatever part of the day it is for you today. And welcome to my page, Empower Your Business Online. And my, for those of you who I've not met before, my name is Olive Dodd. And if you're joining me live, please uh, tell me where you're coming from, your name, and so I can say hello. And if you're catching me on the replay, then let me know too uh, your name and uh, where you're coming from. I'd love to shout out with you later. So today I want to talk to you about the first steps you should be doing to start your business online. If you're just starting out then and wanting to build your business online, we don't want to be chasing after people. We want to be attracting people to us and building using social media strategies to build our business online. We don't want that awkwardness of chasing after our family and friends, spamming our products online. So we want to build a business online. And so one of the first steps you should be doing is Facebook Lives. And they are so important. And that's what I want to talk to you about today. So doing Facebook Lives brings your personality to your page. Text and posts and that kind of thing just aren't the same thing. We really need to show your face and so people get to know, like, and trust you. And so Facebook has so many uh, people every month. Something like 2.5 billion people are on Facebook every month. And so there's lots of people out there and we want to attract those people that are attracted to us. Attracted to your vibe, as they say. Show your vibe and attract your tribe. So that's what we want to do so that they are coming to us rather than chasing our families and friends. And the best way to do that is to put yourself out there. And even if you're just starting and you think that uh, you don't have anything to say, there's always something to say to give value and just you know, sh share your growth, show your personality and share exactly where you're coming from. And uh, this is a new page for me. And so I'm just starting out too, but I have have mentors and people behind me and a beautiful community. And so just putting yourself out there and, you know, getting over your ego. Um, it can be very fearful, but it's more important to jump out of your comfort zone and give yourself that little extra push. If you give in to your fears, then you're giving priority to uh, what you think other people think of you rather than priority in your business. So it's a push. It certainly is. I know that. And so you want to just, you know, push your way through that and then you'll feel so good about yourself once you do that to push that blue button to uh, get started. And so, and it's all, hi Judy and Bob, whoever it is, thanks for joining me on live. And it's so much fun when you have other people interacting with you. So yeah, Facebook live is the, the definite way to go to bring value and bring that content on there to, uh, you know, get people to to really know, like, and trust you. And it's when uh, people don't buy um, products and things like that because they just want the products they buy from someone who that they trust. And both here, oh, hi, both of you. Hi, Judy, and hi, Bob. Great to see you on here. Thanks for joining me. And uh, yes, so where was I? Just uh, let me, I have a couple of notes here. Um, yeah, uh, where was I? You want to get lots of eyeballs on you. And so that the more people that you can attract to you, and show yourself out there and just be real and natural. People stuff up all the time and that's okay because it's it's raw and natural and the more authentic you can be. And so you don't have to worry about, you know, um, making mistakes. Um, and the lives are really, uh, they're real content, real people. So people aren't buying from you know someone that's stuffy or anything like that they're uh, getting to know the real you 
And there's so much more of a connection with your audience when you could really be uh, your true self. And so that will, you know, drive more traffic uh, to your page and then and get more engagement. And that's what we want is more engagement. So there's lots of tips on how to do a Facebook Live. And I'll be going into that um, maybe at another time, not today. I just want to keep this very short for today. And so um, if you have any uh, comments that you'd like to make, please uh, let me know uh, <laughs> how you're feeling. And so Judy and Bob are saying that they're not a robot. And you know, that's so nice. Yes, because we're not robots out here. We want to be real. And so that's key. Excellent. Thank you. And yeah, so the key is to, there's so many people out just to summarize there's so many people out there on facebook let's attract them to us we don't want to chase after our family and friends and uh, give value and just jump through that uh, comfort zone and uh, you know get on there and just start once you start then it's so much easier and it's actually a lot of fun especially when you get uh, lots of uh, comments from people and so that's it for me today and I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. Uh, please let me know what you're thinking and uh, we'll have a conversation. So that's great. Thank you for joining me and we'll talk to you again very soon. Bye for now.